Hey, in this video I want to show you how you can play from A Palace. Uh, I will show some uh, utility lineups and some tips and tricks that can help you to get better results while playing from this area of the map in Mirage. So first of all, what do we need to think about when we go to the A Palace area? Uh, so we spawn, we run all the way, uh, and the first thing we have to think about is the fact that the enemy holding from A side can hear us while we're inside the palace and running around. So to prevent that, um, when we have a spawn, we main like we mostly want to start shifting from from this uh, sort of area uh, to make sure that the enemy doesn't know that we are already yeah. inside the palace. Uh, so that's the first thing to keep in mind. Uh, sometimes you want to rush out and just want to run all the way, uh, but that's only in uh, specific uh, situations. So in most cases, when you're alone in, in Palace, you want to make sure that the enemy doesn't know for sure that you're here. So you just shift from this area. Then you have to make sure that you don't get, like that there is no uh, enemy CT inside the Palace area already, because I will show the person's spawning on this uh, bot's position and even on this bot position like if you have a good spawn you can the CT can run all the way uh, and then the quickest way is to just jump up here and then they can already hold this like these angles um, so they can the CT can beat you into the palace uh, if they have a good spawn so you want to make sure that they can't surprise you in that way by just holding these angles really well and then clearing this this area of the map. So once you've cleared the angles and maybe you even want to come all the way over here, so make sure that nobody's clo playing really close. Then you can start with the utility. So what do you want to do with the utility? Uh, in this video I will give you one set of utility that you can use. Uh, so that at least you can use this a few times in a, in a match uh, to surprise the enemies. Um, so in this scenario I'll line up standing right on top of this uh, uh, T where the tiles meet. Uh, then you aim at this patch on the wall, the left patch, and you aim it on the left side of it. And you crouch and left click throw. What this will do is it will create a one way smoke, which allows you to shoot the person from default. So as, as you can see, the CT person doesn't see anything, while playing from inside the, the palace you can easily see someone standing on the default area. Uh, so that's the first trick, that's a one-way smoke uh, to help you get a pick, uh, possibly. Uh, you could also combine the same lineup without crouching, you can like uh, throw this flashbang, it will pop right in the middle of the, the platform, but it's it only is visible like a really short amount of time so nobody will be able to react to it. So the people playing on that angle, the people playing on that angle, on that angle, um, behind the firebox, everyone is everyone's flashed. Uh, even the person who is sort of aggressively standing here can also be flashed by that. Uh, so that's one of the flashes that you can use. Then uh, what I mostly do is I also have one more molotov and one more flash what if I have a full, full util set. In palace the HE is not that useful. Uh, so what I do if I'm in this this part, in this uh, edge of the, the wall, I'll line up right over there. And what it does is it just bounces the, the molotov under the wood. So the people standing under wood uh, can uh, get burned and they will have to run out probably exit that way or that way so then they can get caught from the players coming out of uh, the tetris area so they hold this angle your teammates hold this angle and they will get an easy frag uh, so then you've supported your team uh, in the a take if you're doing something together and then you can even uh, follow this up with this flashbang and what that does it pops right over here so it flashes the people from uh, city, it flashes the people from uh, jungle and bench of course and even people that are white peaking the angle from the stairs are flashed. Uh, yeah and, and 
default of your stuff. We already eliminated that guy. Um, so yeah, that's it for today in this video. And I hope it was useful for taking the, the A Palace area on Mirage. And it can get you some easy frags on, while you're playing matchmaking or uh, any parks. Good luck and see you in the next one.